Hundreds of thousands of people celebrating Vasaki in BC this month. There is one man from Vancouver who really stands out. He is a Sikh of Chinese descent, and that puts him among a very small group in the world. Bill Puri has his story. Yeah. People see people with turbans and beards. A stroll through Chinatown often generates a chuckle about how local merchants react to a turban and a beard. Right away, they, they would talk to me in English, and then when I respond in Cantonese, they all, you know, big surprise. Pat Zing Chung is fluent in both Cantonese and Mandarin because he's of Chinese descent from Hong Kong. But his religion, Sikhism, comes from India. I enjoy being in the company of the Sangat and listen to Keaton and praying. Being in the company of the congregation and listening to hymns. Chung frequents various Metro Vancouver Sikh temples or Gurdwara several times a week. <laughs> Chung is an avid photographer. It was another walk in Chinatown five years ago that changed Chung's life when he came upon a volunteer group that serves meals on the downtown east side. There you go. Thank you, God bless you. Thank you. I was told um, they are the sick people. They offer free food for everybody every Sunday. And I find this very um, admirable. He has volunteered with Guru Nanak's Free Kitchen every Sunday ever since. Along the way, Chung has studied Sikhism and adopted several of its tenets. As a sign of faith, he now has uncut hair and wears a turban and a steel bracelet called a kara. Every time after I, I, I spend a couple of hours uh, with the Free Kitchens doing seva, it makes me feel good. And what is seva? Seva is selfless service. Chung came to BC to Fort St. James in 1973 to help his family run a local Chinese restaurant. Now his parents are gone and his siblings refuse to accept his new life as a Sikh. It has been a constant struggle as much as I yawn for their love and acceptance but I don't think uh, it's going to happen sadly. Almost 40 years ago Chung moved to Vancouver Running is a passion. Come on. <laughs> Wherever he goes, Chung turns heads. While Sikhism is the fifth largest religion in the world, Sikhs of Chinese descent are few. Just meet Ko. I'm a In Vancouver, Pat Sing Chung's ultimate goal is to become a baptized Sikh. It makes me feel confidence and feels good and because I know I'm doing the right thing and, uh, and I'm happy. Bell Puri, CBC News, Vancouver.